Hey Simstars, it's Cece, and welcome to a, another Halloween-themed cast. This time we are actually doing a vampire without the vampire pack. So, Celine Nosterius is a vampire lady, but I don't have the vampire pack, so we are creating her based purely on CC and attitude. And um, she's actually part of a collab that I'm doing with a bunch of other Sims. You can see them in the description below. But basically, they all created a vampire lair for her. And um, each one of them did a room in the build. And it looks absolutely incredible. Um, unfortunately, I don't have the vampire pack, like I said. So I couldn't create a room. So instead, I created the sim that would live in the lair. So this is Celine. She is the uh, supreme vampire. She absolutely loves being a vampire. Um, as you can see from the side, she's evil, she's hot-headed, and she's a snob. So in her mind, she is just above every other person. Um, she has absolutely no concern for human life. She is perfectly fine drinking from, killing, um, ending any sim that gets in her way. Um, she just, she totally is okay with not having a soul. Um, she is just like the most evil sim you could think of. And I gave her this amazing dress. Like, look at those sleeves. Look at that body. She is just rocking it so hard. Um, and I love her little bat earrings and necklace. Um, I think she just looks incredible. I also decided to give her a daughter. So she has a teen daughter. Um, her daughter's name is Selena. So she's named after her mom. And um, Selena is a little bit different than her mom. So she was born, um, you know, evil as well. But she w at first didn't want to be a vampire. And she really fought against it. And her mother actually had to make a deal with the devil to sell her soul in order for her to really become the evil daughter that Selene always wanted. And so in that case, You'll see in a little bit that her skin is cracked. She actually lost her eyes. She really went through this transformation process and came out the other end just not as good as she was going in. Um, so she is evil now, but mostly it's because of how angry she is at her mother. Um, so you can see that she just doesn't have eyes anymore. They're just blackness there. Um, she does not feel empathy. She does not feel um, compassion. She just feels anger. That's all she feels all the time. Um, and that's really sad because, you know, she could have been a really good sim and she didn't want to be a vampire and that would have been okay if her mother hadn't been so conniving and evil. So I really loved these pants that she actually um, defaulted to, so I really wanted to keep those. But I wanted to change her top to be a little bit more vampire-like. Um, I was going to give her this one, but then uh, my husband actually reminded me that vampires do not like upside-down crosses. So we did not do the upside-down cross. Um, but I wanted to keep her in some dark colors. I wanted to show kind of how upset she is and how depressed she is in her current state. I mean, she is unable to feel happiness. Like, it's it's horrible. It's not good. Um, so this is her outfit. Um, I also do give her some shoes, of course, because she needs some shoes. Um, and then finally, the last thing I do is I actually give her this cracked face. So you can see that she has been both physically and emotionally destroyed by her mother. So she does still want to find true love, um, maybe to make up for the fact that she doesn't have a soul, um, but she is still evil. So coming up next um, are the last two sims in this um, cast. And I just randomized them because these two are um, human uh, juice boxes for the Sims. Um, so for Celine and Selena, um, they actually captured two Sims 
and they live in like a little prison in the house. Um, and so these two Sims are just basically there to be fed on. And um, so I didn't really, it didn't really matter what they look like. I just kind of randomized everything. Um, I did say that Kelvin was a family man and that um, Adeline kind of wanted to be rich, but that's really it. So please check out the other folks in the collab. I hope you enjoyed this video. To all you Sim stars out there, hope you have a very spooky day.